Hey, the other day, my university day, rainbow was shining, the day is beautiful, and I saw my friend walking towards me with the brightest smile ever. And he said, Wow, two of the most selfish people in this world walking together side by side. Wait, you mean like me and my friend? Two selfish people? Yeah, two of you, the world's most selfish people walking together. Now, at first I was like, Okay, but that's your opinion. I'm not gonna take it in. And I remember just going back at home and going like, Nah, I don't think I really care. But I think I sort of care. I'm bothered by it. So, I call him up and go like, Hey, I just wanted to call you to kind of understand why, you know, you make your comment this morning. Oh, no, 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 no. What I mean was just that the other day, when I asked you to drive my friend back home, you were not free. And your Christmas present for me is also really cheap. Yeah. And at first, I thought I took it in. I just listened to some of this feedback and I'm like, okay, fair feedback. But after a while, I'm just noticing myself feeling like, my god, did you notice how much struggle I was in? My business was struggling, my relationship was struggling, and even my dog is freaking struggling, and you didn't notice any of this thing as a friend, and now you're telling me that I can't take care of you? So in short, I just become this really self fractured state of mind. But a few months later, I happened to stumble upon Tom Bilyeu's video, and he shared about how feedback is like someone throwing a golden nugget at your head. It is very painful when it knocks onto our head, but if we are willing to pick it up, it still is a piece of golden nugget. Now, of course, I'm not telling you to knock your head somewhere because that will get you concussion. But the valuable part is that even though the feedback feels a lot like If you get to sit in, be with that feedback, take in the lessons, that's when we can really identify where we can improve in our life. Because when I sat with it, I realized, okay, there were times in my life that I could have done things better and really care for other people a little bit more. Basically, long story short, when someone gives you criticism, it may feel or taste like shit at the moment, but we can use it as a fertilizer. Take care.